Hi everyone, it's Robin and welcome back to another Thrift Store Thursday, my absolute favorite day of the week. I hope you guys are excited about today's haul because I found some awesome things. I found some Fire King, I found some Federal Glass, and I also found some prints that are super duper adorable and I just think this is a great haul so let's go ahead and jump right in. Alright, so I went to two different thrift stores this week. Um, first one was Goodwill. I found two things there and they are both adorable. And then I went to Unique and at Unique, I made out like a banshee, I feel like. <laughs> so let's go ahead and start with um, Goodwill. All right, so the first thing I picked up at Goodwill is a framed print, which I saw and absolutely fell in love with. I think I've seen it in the past, but for some reason it really struck me this week and it's in a frame that I absolutely love. So it's like totally ready to go. It was only $4.99 and it is super adorable. It, it looks like this. Isn't this the cutest little illustration you have ever seen? He is just adorable. <laughs> it says down on the bottom, bless us all. And then it does have a name on it. What does it say? Charlotte, Charlotte by BYI. Now, if I remember correctly, I have seen something like this before, and I think there is a girl that goes with this, but I am not positive. Um, many of you probably already will know, so let me know in the comments if you think there's a girl. Like, I think she's, you know, sitting facing the other way and has a pink jammy set on, but I'm not positive. But, anyways, I thought this was super sweet. And would go very, very well with another print that's like a reproduction print um, that I already have in my bedroom. So I think this will go very, very nicely with that. So I just think it is so cool. It's vintage and I love it and I think it is awesome. All right, so the next item I picked up is a little, I don't know what you call it. I call it a little mini terrine because it, that reminds, is what it reminds me of. It's some sort of covered dish, serving dish, and it looks like this. Isn't it gorgeous? Absolutely beautiful. It's got cute little feet. It's got cute little handles, even on top. And then it's got this gorgeous floral print on it in this pale, pale blue color, which I think is absolutely gorgeous. Um, it does, it was, what was it? It was $4.99, and then it does have this little insert that goes on inside. It's got a hole in it. Bottom is kind of raised, so I'm assuming that you put stuff in it, and then the juices can run down in the bottom so things don't get soggy. I don't know. I'm assuming that's what it's for. I have no idea. But um, it does have a marking on the back, which is not very legible, but I'm. it's like half of a stamp, basically. But I think it is supposed to say Johnson Brothers England. Something like that is kind of what it looks like to me. So, anyways, regardless, I think it is absolutely gorgeous. And I love it so much. I think it is just so pretty. You guys know how much I love my soup trains and stuff. And I love the miniatures as well. So, this will get a lot of use from me, I am sure. <laughs> All right, so then moving on to the next thrift store, I went to Unique, and I did have a 20% off code or coupon that day that I went. So I got 25% off of all the items that I picked up. And the first thing I picked up was $1.36, and it is a little kitchen gadget of some sort. I do not know what it is, but it does have a handle that looks like it's got some remnants of red paint on it, which is very cool. You guys know how much I am, um, you know, collecting things with red handles. So I'm not quite sure what this even is. I've never used anything like this before, but of course it has a wood handle, which is what I'm looking for. And to me, if I had to guess, I would use this to like cut a tomato or an egg or something. It's got like one side is like shredded, serrated, is that a word? Like a knife, and the other side is, is you know, smooth. But it does, oh, it does have some words on it. Let me try to read the words. <laughs> oh, yeah, it does say tomato, and then it says Holland. T 
tomato Holland. So anyways, so it must be for tomato, which is awesome because I love tomatoes. Have you ever had a tomato sandwich? Tomato sandwiches in the middle of the summer are absolutely fabulous. Not just in the middle of the summer, but to me, tomatoes right off the vine on a sandwich with toasted bread is so delicious. Absolutely delicious. I think that's what I should, oh, don't have any tomatoes, but that would be a really nice thing to have for lunch. But anyways, we're going off on a bat rabbit trail. Anyways, I'm sorry, I'm, but anyways, anyways, I thought this was really cool, so I had to pick it up, and it was, you know, under $2, so that's good and cool, so I can add it to my collection of wood-handled kitchen utensils, which I think is awesome. So then I did find a couple Christmas things. Like, this year, you guys, I have been having terrible, well, not terrible luck. I have found a few things that are Christmas-related but every time I go to the thrift store, it's like one thing here, one thing there. I think I found some angels. I found some stockings, which I love. And I think I found a couple tins. But like the ornaments that I'm constantly looking for and stuff like that, it's just not out there this year at the thrift stores. So I don't know what they're doing with them or if they're, I don't know if they just don't have them this year or what. But I was just like, get the Christmas stuff out. <laughs> Anyways, so I have kind of been bummed with the selection of Christmas decor to look through at the thrift stores lately. But, that being said, I did find a few things. The first thing I found was a two-pack of little um, fingertip towels, I guess you would call them. Um, they were originally 99 so I got them for $0.69. Cents. They are red, and they have these cute little candy canes on them. I thought these were super adorable. They're a little smaller than like your typical hand towel for like the bathroom or whatever. But, so that's why I think they're like the fingertip towels. But they'll work in our kids' bathroom. So there's two of them here and they both have the cute little candy canes on them. And you can tell they've been around for a while. They don't have, the, yeah, the, uh, maker label has been cut off so i have no idea but they look like they're really nice have a nice feel to them if that makes sense and of course i love the candy canes so i picked those up i thought that was awesome then the next thing i found was another one of my knitted stockings that i love so much it was originally 2.99 and i was able to get it for 209 and this one is awesome because it has all the colors that I love to use at Christmas time. It's got the red, it's got the white, it's got the green, and I absolutely adore the pattern on it. It is so cute. It is this right here. Don't you just love this? Oh my gosh, I am so in love with these little wreaths. I think they are so cool. So I'm going to add these, this one into my little hooks over here on the in the kitchen. This is the second one I found this year to go in my collection, so I'm super thrilled about that. <laughs> I'm getting quite a few in my collection. <laughs> Too many to actually like display, which is not a good thing. <laughs> I'll have to come up with different ways to display them. So the next thing I found was a set of two prints. They were originally um, $3.99, so I think I got them for like $2.79 or something like that. Um, but I know that these prints Come, there's a set of four that go together, and I have only seen them in the larger size, like, you know, 11 by 12 or something like that. But anyways, I was thrilled to find these smaller version ones, but there's only two of the four. Um, but that's all right. <laughs> so the first one is perfect for winter time. It is this little girl right here. She's like all dressed up in her little winter finery. And she's just so cute. So I have this one. And then this one is my favorite. <laughs> this one is obviously so cute. There's this one right here. And she's so adorable. And she's got a little cat on her shoulder. She's holding it. I think it is so cute. So I'm not sure if I'm going to keep these in the original frames. They're not great frames. They're kind of like, I'm not going to keep them in these frames. They will definitely go in a different frame. Because these are just like faux wood kind of frames, if you know what I mean. 
So I'll try to find some different frames to put these in, and then I'm hoping that they will go in my bedroom along with this other little picture and the ones that I have for my room. I think it'll look so cute in there. So I was very thrilled to see those because I actually have been looking for the set. Now I just need to find the other two that go with it. Like once a baby, I know for sure, like, you know, the little baby on its tummy or something like that. And then there's another girl. And I can't remember exactly. But anyways, I love those prints. I think they are so cute. So, love those. All right, so the next three things I am super excited to share with you guys. I like, so lucked out. Um, I love anything Pyrex, Fire King, Fedril. Is there another one? Oh, Glass Bake. I love all those kind of things. And I think they are so awesome. But in my area, they are really, really hard to find. So to start off with, I found two Fire King pieces, which I'm so thrilled about. And both of the patterns on them, I am absolutely in love with. Uh, the first one is a one quart casserole dish. And I picked it up for $2.79, which I think is awesome. And it looks like this. Oh, there we go. This is the Primrose pattern. And I think it is absolutely gorgeous. It's got the red and a little bit of pink in it. And I think it'll go really nicely with my um, Strawberry Hill dishes that I collect here in my kitchen. So I'm actually thinking I might start collecting this pattern on a regular. Like I see it occasionally now and then like in plates and saucers and cups and stuff. So I'm thinking I might start collecting this piece, this pattern because I, I really do love it. So I was super thrilled to find this one. And then I found another Fire King piece. This is a casserole dish as well. But this one is slightly larger in that it is a one and a half quart um, version. And it looks like this right here. There we go. It's focusing now. Now, if I remember correctly, this pattern is called Daisy. And I love this pattern, too. Like, these three color combinations, this color combination is absolutely gorgeous to me. And I'm thinking, wouldn't this be fun to use this color combination for my spring and summer look in my kitchen? I'm thinking I would love that very, very much. The yellow, the little turquoise, and the red. I think it is really, really pretty. Um, this one was $4.19, originally $5.99. And both of these pieces are in excellent condition. And I think they go nicely together. So, I think I start, should start um, <laughs> collecting these. Because I actually find Fire King much easier around my area than I do Pyrex. Like, I hardly ever find Pyrex. And if I do find Pyrex, it's like really bad condition and the fact like the color is almost gone, that sort of thing. Or in a pattern that I really don't like. So if I figure if I'm going to collect Pyrex, which I would love to, I should at least pick a pattern that I like. So since I don't ever find that patterns, I think I'm going to go with these. <laughs> so loving those. I think they're so awesome and oh, so useful too. I love this kind of stuff that I can throw into my cabinets and I can use on a daily basis. I absolutely love that. So. All right, so my last item to share with you today is the one I am super, super duper thrilled about. It is a federal glass um, casserole dish with a lid. And I think it is amazing. It was originally $8.99 and I picked it up for $6.29. And it looks like this. Don't you just love this pattern? Um, I've heard this pattern called two different things, either Atomic Snowflake or Atomic Starburst. So I'm not quite sure which one it actually is, but I love it. Love the fact that it's got the lid on it, and I just love the black, white, and gold. I think that is so, so cool. So... I think that is pretty cool. And it's got the Starburst on them. You guys know how much I love the Starburst. So I thought that was pretty neat. And then I did find a little custard bowl that matched it as well. So this was originally $1.99, so I got it for $1.39. So I loved that. And I actually found one of these 
not too long ago in my thrifting as well. So that gives me two of these little custard cups. So loving this as well. And I think that it's awesome that it matches. So I think that this pattern is so cool because it's got the, you know, the atomic, you know, got the starburst on it. And I love it just as much as these two patterns. So, I mean, what's the person to do? <laughs> I just don't know. But what I'm thinking would be cool is use these in my kitchen for like summer and springtime. And then in the winter, switch over to red along with this stuff with the gold and the black for like my winter and fall look. So I don't know. We'll see. But regardless, I don't really care. I will mix and match it it's all with no problems whatsoever <laughs> so absolutely love this i could not i was saw it on the shelf and i could not believe it i cannot believe it was still there i just think it is gorgeous and it is in perfect condition there's absolutely nothing wrong with it so i love this so much so all right so that is what i picked up this week at the thrift store i feel like i had a great haul again this week <laughs> which is awesome and some very useful items as well as decorative items so that is amazing so I hope you guys enjoyed today's haul I had a lot of fun sharing it with you um, I would love to know which is your favorite piece that I picked up and of course if you went thrifting this past week in your neck of the woods I would love to know what you found that has you excited so leave me a comment down below if you guys are new I would love it if you would hit that subscribe button and become part of my YouTube family and of course I would love it if you guys could hit that thumbs up for me <laughs> that would be lovely all right guys so I will see you guys next week for another thrift store Thursday haul um, but there are a few exciting videos coming up between now and then so I will see you in my next video Bye now.